I am Musket Stewart, I'm Nick Fantaquachi here, back with another video. Today we are doing another VeggieTales reaction of Eevee the Original Master. Let's go! Now, we haven't basically done a reaction since 2020 of May of 2000 of whatever you- You mean just the both of us? Yeah, just the both of us. Because the last time we reacted was with Phil with the- what is it? The Impractical Jokers? Yeah, the Impractical Jokers. Can I just let it be- straight with that didn't work as planned but anyways we have 2021 which i hope is going to be a better year for us including me and my brother yep. and without further ado be sure hit the subscribe button and click on the notification bell after you do so Our constant uploads all right we're going to be doing right, two reaction videos we're going to do when's god i'm scared, scared and the grapes of wrath god wants me to forget them the so without further ado do this is what he does wait, 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 wait. let's get to it hello everybody Evie, the original master here oh, and today <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Right, this, this episode. Is where he does we will be reviewing where yes. where i'm scared wait, 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 wait i need to get okay it's summer 21st okay let's go wait, 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 i wasn't bored yet come on without further ado wait 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 move 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 Let's review Let's it. Let's get to it. <laughs> Hi, kids, and welcome oh to Veggie Oh, my Tales. God. I'm Bob the Tomato, <laughs> and I'm Larry the Cucumber. Oh, my God. Oh, my I God. God. CGI is so bad. Look at the voice bad animation. Look how oh bad the text is. And we're here to answer your questions. That's right. Oh, so you're here to answer my questions. Okay. <laughs> A, Ways. this show is called Veggie Tales, right? <laughs> B, Bob, you are not a vegetable. You are clearly a fruit. Bob he is a fruit. If it's called Veggie Tales, then why are you here? And C, wow. what is up with the squashing animation? I mean, was Phil Vitcher trying, trying to freak the kids out? I mean, seriously, this check this animation out again. And we're here to answer your question. Answer your question. Answer your question. So, Anderson from Phoenix, Arizona. This is from 1993. Why? Because here's why. Dear Bob and Larry, I am six years old. Sometimes I think there are monsters in my closet. That makes me real scared. Wait, Can you help wait for me? <laughs> okay, Lucy. I understand the problem that you're having through. But are you having some mucus problems? <laughs> you said monsters under my closet. It's not like you have like, mucus build up into your lungs. Oh my monsters in my closet. Did the person <laughs> or anything took any mucus in that before oh, yes, she he did. shot this? Because the way how she talked is, she sounded like she had like bunches of mucus built up into her throat oh without bother God. clearing oh, it. So Bob, Larry, because did not get any letters from random kids. Like and the fact that this is the only VeggieTales episode no before, I, know. I don't know, the 2000s and 10s, where um, they had a voiceover for the yep. kid reading the letter. There's some creepy stuff right here. I know. Now, Lucy Anderson, first check to see if it's just your slippers. And then watch this story about when Junior Asparagus got a little bit scared. Oh, brother, let the madness begin. Junior Asparagus. I know. It's, you it's guys just so creepy. You tell that I hate this character. You and you're about to find it out five. right now. So, Q film. In reality, mm, like, big idea production. Right Tales from the CRISPR. Very right? cool What's introduction. Like oh my gosh, the texture. <laughs> I can't take it. <laughs> well, it is it's 1993. I know. So as you guys can tell that this is a parody of the British novel Frankenstein by Mary Shelley. Which we can only and tell. This is actually some pretty weird cinematography right here. And my goodness, look at the textures. I don't know. Rock to me! No, this way! Oh look at it going! Frankenstein! Where are you going? It's it. I know. The first thing he does, he's just uh, gonna get I'm some sorry, guys, anything right. I have to expose Franken salary. Yeah, I know. You look like a freaking airhead with screws. That is so really, toxic. Really, dude? Come on. It's toxic. In a oh, looky here. Very bad CGI animation. Wow. Good job, Phil Vischer. And good job, Mark. And here we and are, ladies here and gentlemen. Is the main protagonist of the Junior video series, freaking Junior Asparagus. Now, for this next scene, I'm going to be very quiet oh, so you can hear his voice sick. very clearly. Just listen to his voice, and you can tell me 
how bad oh, it, it is. is the first step. You know I'm about to. Ouch! I know. Junior. It's time for bed. J just four more minutes. Oh my goodness. Oh, like, this is the first thing that, that no, he's going to say. He's like, he's just like, four more minutes. Like and you lied. Yes, Junior is actually a boy. Oh and his voice God. is very annoying. It's about just four more minutes. You better go to bed like your mom says. Or else you're going to get a frying pan up your butthole. Just yeah, like any said. other school children, <laughs> they beg their parents to stay up even later so they can watch a film that they advice. know they're going to be scared of. Junior Asparagus, you're not funny, you're one-dimensional, and I hate you, and I wish I can bash you over the head with that giant yellow baseball cap. I know. Well, yeah, you better like it, or else I'm gonna come to your house with a nuke like launcher. It. Yeah. I'm not scared. Are you sure? Because you sound like it. Of course. Just wait for this. <laughs> oh, oh. What the heck face. just happened here? With the large bulging eyes and the picture frame turning from happy to this staring. Is this is supposed what to be a kid's show, Phil Fisher. Come dead. on. So you lied to the viewer. You know what they say? <laughs> 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 you <laughs> Junior. So after that creepy <laughs> montage, Junior Asparagus runs up to his room like a little child. Oh, oh there wait, you go. He has a child. Oh, bad CGI animation. I know. I just had to fix the obvious. Sorry about that. I'm not scared. Oh, How many times are you going to say it? Scared, just stop I'm saying it. You out. What is it's just do what you got to do. Come on. Like, like, Jeez, 1993 was terrible. No. You thought Junior's I know eyes just were six, out of socks are scary. You should check this out. Boy, this is creepy. Yes, but you don't need to say it every week. I'm Bob. I'm a tomato, and I'm here to Just help. Come from I'm here to help. I'm here to help. Oh my! To help you. <laughs> this is so you talk bad. About you're to help them. And Junior, what are you talking about? Who are they, dude? Oh yeah, look at your Easter bedroom. egg. You have a picture the first of Bob and Larry oh on your wall, no, sure and you talk about you don't know who they nice. are, and where's the stars at? This is so badly CGI. Oh Even my. Phil Drescher didn't bother putting stars so in the night gosh. sky. Man, this is the okay, first episode of Nori Ann's problem. There's something in my uh, toy chest. All right. Man, screw the toy chest, <laughs> Junior. Oh, stretching and scaring off. It's, a, it's baby pickle. Uh, it's a cucumber. Yeah, Junior, that's a cucumber. Yeah, those eyes are as creepy, my vegetables, kid. So, so after crashing serious. to his ceiling, Bob and Larry decide to help Junior out with his little God. monster problem. And boy, is there some bad I CGI. I, I'm sorry. I'm this is the first thing we're going to see bad CGI, CGI animation. And Bob ain't having none of this. It's crashing either. like a Corridian. What is <laughs> going on here? Oh, well, yeah. That is some weird oh, camera angles right there. Oh, my God. This is a Christian show. It's bad enough. Yeah, close shots up with the characters singing the VeggieTales theme song at the very ending when the flowers came from the sky. That's no excuse for you to make these really weird camera angles. Stop it, Phil. Mm -hmm. Why? How, 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 how could you guys help me? Whoa, Junior. You be the original master of just added that one. So you can totally more than usual. In that very sarcastic but way. But actually, that was what? quite funny. Well, we were just going to sing you a little song. That's all. But since you weren't even scared, I, I guess I guess we'll just be on our way. Yep. see you later. No, wait. I guess maybe a little song might be nice. Well, since you're in the neighborhood. Junior, what? <laughs> you want them to sing oh the song, yet you make God. that very creepy face. That is so you are serious. What? So Bob tells Junior that he's not going to sing the song, and Junior freaking Everyone's spazzes out. Sing the song. Oh, God. Uh, what did Phil Vischer ever learn? This is supposed to be a Christian a show. animated show for kids. There. And you got the characters stretching their body no, ways up against the camera. God. This is totally unnatural. And Junior's spazzing it's out. Unnecessary. Oh, it's unnecessary. Bob is it's not going to sing in the song. The typical five-year-olds, typical five-year-olds. They're little kids. They're not going to learn through life. So they're going to freak out. You know what? You know, I think it's time to say, to say, time to get the bleach. Song to <laughs> yeah, let's get the Junior, bleach. Junior, you're going to spank it from your dad. No, you know what? I'm gonna provide the spanking. Yeah, I'm that, like, that you, you do the spank. Yeah, like, Come on, man. Yummy, yummy. So Bob begins. <gasps> yummy, <singing>. yummy. <laughs> you were lying in your bed. Sorry, I've gone crazy for a second. You were feeling kind of sleepy, Emma. but you I know. couldn't close your eyes because the room was getting creepy. 
Can you like back away, please? Holy cow! Love that this okay, is PG-13 in the house. Now. Stop stretching like that. What is this? This is a dark episode. Oh, that is stupid. Ooh, stupid. very cool CGI. Good now job, Phil. Like you are a tomato. Oh, you don't man. have a heart. <laughs> what is up with the weird static shock electricity you know, sounds what? coming through the door? What's going on here? Freak the kids out? Yeah. It's like a repetitive, like... Yeah, I, I can't even say anything about this. This is the best part. On. Wait for it. Here we go now. And I have to say this. Junior actually says one of the best quotes he has ever said in the entire series. What are you going to do? I'm going to call the police. The police. There we go. There we go. Let's call them for Junior Asparagus. Junior Asparagus for president. Do anything. 2022. Why? Oh, wait, no, that was yeah, 1994. Well, oh, it's 1993. Anything. So it's 1993. Junior's having a freak attack about monsters I would, I would in his closet, wonder. and he's saying he wants to call the police, I, but Bob's yeah, saying I, you don't have to do anything. God is bigger than the boogeyman. He's bigger than Godzilla or the monsters on TV. Oh, God is bigger than the boogeyman, and he's watching out for you and me. <laughs> No, 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 it's crazy stuff. Hmm. Gotta get come to f oh. here. Hello, darkness, my old friend. I think I burped, but it's a good people. <laughs> I've come to talk with you again. So Bob gives this is just a little stupidly hilarious about why God is bigger than anything. He could be bigger than the Boogeyman, King Kong, and we got some more very bad, creepily stretching animations from Vil Vischer and Mark. <laughs> there we go. Oh, by the way, this next scene is pretty funny, so I'm gonna turn up the volume <laughs> for this. Yeah, what right. do you see? Yeah, over there. My curtains. No, out the window, up in the sky. Oh my gosh, are you both going to fight for each other? And why do they look so angry in this scene? I mean, this is the pilot episode of Veggie Tales, and the look curtains are like about to so fight serious. each other. <laughs> this is Bob the Tomato. <laughs> oh, and I see well, finally they cut stars. Yeah, for only that one scene. Not out of nothing. He just went. Well, dang, Larry, that was kind of rude of you for sticking your tongue out at four inches. That is Asparagus. rude, Larry. That Don't do lecture, that in a kid's Junior show. Junior probably knows that nothing in his closet is now scary. Now look what you've done to the kids. They're going to stick their tongues now. out. We're probably right? in school. Uh, Thanks a lot. Nope. Uh, I'm breaking Sally's back. Yeah, <laughs> go uh, into the. Uh, actually, my name is Phil Winkelstein. Why <laughs> all these characters keep falling from the oh ceiling? Have you ever heard of the front what door? Is this to oh me? my god! <laughs> Toledo. What? <laughs> yeah, that was really, like, that's really that was funny Junior, though. You are so funny in this episode. I I'm know. Even though Junior's voice is it, annoying, it, it was his, just the first episode. And his reactions now. are so hilarious. Junior is like, so pissed. This is, this is like, I know, go for it. One more time. Anyways, Frank and Salary was Frank just an actor. Above Frank 10. This is 11 out of 10. Junior that he's Funny. not trying to I be can't scary. Take it he's just doing it for the show. And yes, this is some very creepy <laughs> cinematography. So when I'm lying in my bed. Then the most popular song in recent ages. And the furniture starts creeping. I'll just laugh and say, hey, cut that out! Why don't you cut that yeah, out? Those those stretching those eyes make your serious face is my goodness. Smash over the head with a tennis racket. So when I get scared, I'll think of him and close my eyes and smile. I think he's going to do it just throw the bleach out the window. <laughs> Thank you very much. Then they all start singing God is Bigger again. I can't believe because he is. it. Oh my gosh, this is where wait, the animation wait, wait, wait. gets even more creepier. Oh 
That is no, some no, of the that most is fraud no, 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 Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Whose idea was it to oh animate gosh. them like this? So, Are they having seizures? in the bed. They're all going. Bro, freaking salary is having a freaking seizure. Super. Oh my! Look at the bed. Look at the bed. Oh my! I, no, stop! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're having <laughs> epilepsy seizures right now. Even Bob can't even handle it. <laughs> oh my goodness. What? This is so real. Then after that really catchy musical number, Junior's dad shows up. Oh, yes, this is Junior's dad. The dumbest dad of all time. Asparagus, and we don't know his name. But you know, Frank and Celery is really a guy named Phil from Toledo. Well, and he's really not scary at all. And besides, God is bigger than any of them, and even though he doesn't squirt slime out of his ears, he made the whole universe, and he's taking good care of me, too. Um, well, you're this right. You're not a bad look. You're supposed to be his dad. Oh, my Don't God. Why are you trusting son? your son <laughs> for those coincidence words? Are you serious? Wow. Yeah, come on. Get so after the worst father of the year leaves, Junior Thank finally you. goes to sleep, singing to himself about the God is Bigger song, ending off with a very bad ending instrumental version of the song. You don't even hear it. And there we have it, everybody. That was my <laughs> review of that. Where's God When I'm Scared. But you're probably asking yourself, whoa, you forgot the Daniel story. You're not doing that. I don't have time for this. I'm not going to sit here and review the entire episode, the two segments. I'm only reviewing the, the segments that focus the title of the video. So yeah, and this is why we're going to go on to the next episode. Why is God where I'm going to forget them? Before we go, it's time to hear a verse from Cordy. Oh, yeah, so, we can't well, forget about this. Oh, this is one of my favorites. Look at Bob right now. He's just like, he just... He hates his son. This is like way before. And yes, you guys, this is Bob's The Tomatoes Biggest Pet <laughs> The What Have We Learned Today song. I love I'm not gonna lie, it's actually pretty catchy. It is catchy. Uh, as I was saying, we're... <laughs> <laughs> yes! That is, that's a big meme going on from the, the internet right there. Shut up! <laughs> pound ground beef with three slices of <laughs> yummy, this is our recipe for yummy, yummy, yummy. Oh yeah, yummy, oh, yummy. Yeah. Like that. Okay, Bob, just continue making your very funny, angry facial expressions. <laughs> that would be great. I love this character. And God said, in Isaiah 41, oh, oh, this is so man. Fear, for I am with you. Oh, yeah. I'm a, mm. So the next time you get scared, just remember that verse. And tonight, this like more. This, why don't you pray with your mom or dad and thank God for always looking out for you? Yeah, that's a good idea. Well, that's wow. all for now. Until you had to do that, ever, Larry. God made you special, How and he loves you very much. Well, bye. Oh, no. Bye. Oh. And there you have it, everyone. That was the Let's see the final fairy before we go to the next one. Here's my verdict. Well, this was 1993, so of course the CGI was bad. Even like, today's standards. Yeah. In 1993 perspective, it was alright. It was okay animation, I guess. It was alright. Um, the songs were catchy. I actually did. Yeah, like that's the, the biggest thing about Fantasy Tales. I think the Fantasy Tales music are always. Bob's facial expressions like, when he got angry from the hilarious. Yep. And Junior's reactions to Frank and Salary. That was an A plus. That was an S. Honestly, the. Nope, 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 nope. The CGI is one of the big. Sorry, the animation was creepy. Alright, you know what, guys? Where we go? Go for now. All right. Well, that's all I got for today. The grapes of wrath. Here we go. Next. Here we go. Hey kids, welcome to VeggieTales. Well, yeah, it, do, it did improve a little bit. The cucumber, and we're here to we'll answer your questions. Voice. Yeah. <laughs> well, hello there, Larry and Bob. Nice to see you guys again. Yeah. Um, I know I gave you guys some very, very harsh reviews. Yeah, negative on the first episode review. Yeah. When I'm scared. But, but again, I mean, it was pretty funny in the first. From you but guys. now. He just, and he'd be the original sure master who has been more mature, yeah. so, so this is where it gets a little bit uh, more in the soft. Now, Larry. More possible. Yeah, Bob. So. The other day, I was walking home mm -hmm. from my bowling league. <laughs> whoa, 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 pause. A, wait, pause. what? Pause. A bowling league? Bob, you're already oh, taking an L. 
You see, yeah, has a huge, big fatty L. And you arms. don't have legs, so you can't walk. Soft arms and legs. Two, how can you bowl with no arms? I mean, seriously. Don't forget, yes, you're I know a fruit. that they have invisible arms and veggie tails, <laughs> but that does not make an excuse for Bob to say walk or with the fact he has no legs. Not have arms really, Phil legs. Visser? Really? I know. You gotta do better, man. So Bob though. tells yeah. Larry about Marco, one of their TV friends, about his sister hitting him. So then his mom says, you should forgive him, but why? You want proof? I'll show you the clip. Now Marco had a question for us. He said that when his baby sister does something that makes him mad, and then she says she's sorry, well, Marco's mom says he needs to forgive her. Why does he have to forgive? Oh, that's a good question. Oh, that's a very good question. Precise so the reason why um, you should forgive your sister, that is your sibling. People Even though your sister is, makes you is, mad or whatnot, and she does something problem. bad that, that you don't Boys like, are, it is yeah, always nice to forgive. Because if you don't <clears throat> forgive her, she'll get upset and start annoying you by screaming and hollering. That's why forgiveness is a very important thing, kids. For life, mm. yeah. Well, I know. I'll tell Marco the story of the Grapes of Wrath. Ooh, yes, indeed. Grapes, the grapes of, of Wrath. Mm. It's so actually a real story. story about Who's the Grapes of Wrath, where Bob constantly interrupts Oh, you guys know I don't need to say it. Nope, 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 the story nope, nope. is not told Get correctly. The bleach. Get, oh. Bob, just keep your mouth shut and let Larry tell the story. Before he used to he has more than you do. Upon a time, there yeah, were some like, very cranky that's... grapes. Video. That's in this one. Is this bad. beat is so not bad. Veggie Tales, not bad, but I think that truck needs a little bit more, more. Mm, old, better music. Old yeah. Old. <laughs> this very, very odd looking truck with even more bad CGI than the first episode had while singing this very, very weird that song. Is, oh my goodness. Whoa. Okay, here we go with the close up. Phil Fisher, will you Yo, ever freaking yeah, learn? Yeah, oh my god, it's not the close ups. He's the father of yeah. these two children in the back seat. This is his first yeah. appearance. And they have a very strong southern accent. Just later up yeah. which I honestly don't know. They why. started out to so realize. The great Sarah consists of Paul Grape, the one in the front who's driving, Ma Grape, um, the wife sitting next to him, and their two children, Tom and Rosie. And to be honest, Ma Grape, Tom, and Rosie does not appear anywhere else after this episode. Yeah, Only Paul true. Grape. So Paul Grape serves as the main protagonist of he is the main protagonist. With See, this very bad he's in the right car. over there. Oh, what? <laughs> that is not no, good. No, 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 That's no. a big no, no. I already had to deal with Frank and Seller. What's the up first these? Episode, what's up with these? CGI? Are you away? serious? Oh my goodness. And you just see oh, how badly it's the textured same the thing. grass was? Uh, yes, indeed, folks. The grass has no textures. One day, the grapes are out driving around in their car when suddenly they hit a bump. We must have hit a bump. A, that is not a that's bump. a tree that's stomp. A tree stump. And B, where did you get your license from, Paul Grape? And C, yeah. how are you not able to <laughs> see that tree stump? Seriously, see Paul Grape. Bro. You could have easily seen that tree stump if you would have never turned your face to the other direction. You see, Paul Grape? That's exactly why you need to have eyes. And so after go. the car accident, Tom and Rosie begins to roast each other. But being oh. mine, this was released in 1994, so the exposing yeah, will not yeah. be the greatest because it's 1994, it's a kid's show, exposing really wasn't that great back in the day, but here's what they had to say to each other. Hey, what you do that for? I didn't do it, you did, you big possum head. I did not, you taco salad rabbit No, It did too, casserole head, pimento loaf, the guana boy. Oh! <laughs> wow! <laughs> now, Rose, apologize to your brother. Huh? What for? Well, you know he just turned 18 years old. Hold on a minute. So Tom what? is 18 years old, and he is letting his own sister expose him. Tom, 
you got some very bad issues to take care of. Hell <laughs> 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 oh, oh my, my gosh. Rape wants, um, I never um, act like this in my age ever. To an older really brother. Really, dude? 18? No. More like 15 to me. So it appears yeah. that the Grapes of Wrath landed in the house of Junior Asparagus. Oh, That's who's right. back. Junior is back again. Junior Asparagus um, what for revenge. Um, Paul Grape, can you, like, please get away from the camera? You're a little bit way too close, dude. What? Oh, my goodness. No, hmm. <laughs> <laughs> this is strange animation. <laughs> How many more times are you going to go through with this? Come on. Be some kind of a bean or something. So yeah, they it's call an asparagus a bean. a bean. He is clearly not a bean. He's an asparagus. What's that thing he's got on his head? Well, it's yellow. Um, cheese is yellow. Mm-hmm. So that would make him a cheese-headed bean boy. All right, you guys. There were so oh, many problems with the scene right, that I, I know you're the hey, main pro. I know where you are one of the protagonists. Sorry about that. Why boy. would he even so say that? Father, He's Paul not a cheese-headed bean boy. Why are you can't kidding Rosie me? pronounce the color yellow right? It's yellow, not yella. I understand you're supposed to have a southern accent, but seriously. That and C, awful. why is Paul Grape calling Junior a cheese-headed bean boy? He is a senior citizen, and he should know that calling people's names is not right. This is so sad. Coming from a guy this age. You should be if you guys don't know what Sea or is, it's a younger person. <coughs> no, I'm not a bean. Oh, I mean, uh, I'm an asparagus. What the bean boy say? Oh, great. It's time to stop. You're not funny. You're not funny. And Junior Asparagus is trying to introduce know, himself like to you, but you're being so rude. Um, that makes no sense. Being Why? Yeah. Seriously, this episode this is ridiculous. Me over the fact that we got a senior citizen uh, great being so rude to, to a young people. asparagus yeah. like that. Seriously. Hey. Respect your elders, people. Elder Respect your elders. He said he was an asparagus. Who's it? Huh? Stop. Asparagus. What is wrong with you guys? Holy cow, I get so From the Greek. Asparagus. This is sad. He is like five years How old. How does he know this one? Oh brains. my god. And this well, is not cheese time. on my head. It is a hat. A yellow hat. Wow. You, you were doing uh, so junior, good until that, that, that happened. happened. So the Grapes oh, of Wrath begins to start laughing at Junior's very bad hairstyle, which causes him to cry. But why are you grapes. all wearing hats, Junior? Too. I'm on your side. The Grapes of Wrath, you should be You're dead being so in a second. Stupid. I swear. Well, I will put you in a blender so and make gushers out of you. So Junior starts to cry and his father comes in to see what's going on. Thanks a lot, Grapes of Wrath. They were calling me Bean Boy and telling me I had peas on my head. Is that true? Oh, no, 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 we would not do such a thing. No, let's go with those red oh, rabbit wow, lie, man. Wow. Don't you even trust so them. Not only your family is messed up, even your lying is. Don't sit there and lie to Junior's dad like that. Those two brats are 18 years old. They are in oh, high by school. The way, Father Asparagus, his tie is glitching. So Junior's dad comes out to confess yeah, to the grapes yeah, that yeah, they should forgive Junior bit. about making fun this of him. This is still early CGI. Well, uh, gee, I, so. I guess we never really stopped to think about it. Well, it was making you feel, you know. Yeah, we was just having some fun. Didn't mean nothing by it. Yeah, oh. sorry. Sorry. Oh, sorry. 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 Oh, sorry. Didn't mean it. We'll never be mean again. Are you sure, Paul Grape? I don't sure? know about that, Paul Grape. If not, you're gonna be in a blender. Too much smoothies out of you. Junior. I'm dead honest. Okay, that's better. Now, Junior, With those is there anything you'd like to say to the grapes? On to um, skills. Yes. Like what? Junior's dad explained to him that when someone says they're sorry for hurting you, and they really mean it. We need to forgive them. Thank you, Larry. I was just about that to say that. That was a big fact right there. A big it? That okay. fact. I forgive you, grapes. <sighs> <sighs> oh, that's great. All right. Now, doesn't everyone feel better? Oh, well, yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's right. yeah. That's right. Good. It's almost time for supper. Come on inside, Junior. So everything breaks loose when the Grapes of Wrath starts laughing to realize that the name of the asparagus was Junior. And this made Junior very angry. Well, he got whacked <laughs> from a broomstick. Oh, it's a rake. 
and Honestly, then. This is too much. Yeah, I know. They, I told you they lied, and then this happens. Oh, come on. They better not laugh after this. If they do, I suddenly swear to God. We are the grapes of France. <laughs> the first day it ends oh, like oh, there. Oh, oh, you thought that was the ending of the video? Oh, thank you very video. much, EP yeah, the Richard Master. Happens. So, yeah, the Great Sir Raph broke their promise about... But that would not be a kid's um, ending to a fight episode. Name. So Junior acted the tough yeah. guy and tried to fight That was back. false. Good false alarm, people. That was a false Good alarm. Job. So Junior survived the crash by falling into a sandbox, and he's completely covered in sand. And everybody starts laughing at him again. Why? Because the Grapes of Raps are dumb. That's they're all I they're already dumb. Oh, yeah, you know, they finally died. Father Experiment. No, it's not. I said the same uh, thing. Pop too, Grave Mr. is starting to realize in the mother, too. But these Grapes are just dumb. They'll never Thank learn. Thank you. Thank you, both. What do you kids have to say to Junior? Well, at least Ma Grape is the only one. Oh, my character God. You're right. They're 18 years old. Along with Why? Junior and father. Why? The other characters are bad. Oh, Even though the Grapes of Raps being an idiot in the second time around, Junior should still forgive them. Besides Pop Grape. This is an illusion. Thank you, Junior. Think about it. The first time, the Grapes was calling him a bean, and the second time, there was making fun of his name. So Junior has right. no rights to say sorry to those idiotic Grapes that needs to be in a blender. So now, Bob and Larry convinces Junior that he needs to say sorry to the Grapes. Oh my god. Why, Larry? Why, Bob? Why, Why? you have to force you Junior Experiments? Well, I thought I hate Junior Experiments in the first episode, but now Bob and Larry started to open this. And when the chuck pins me up and throw me in the sand. And you're telling me I'm supposed to forgive him again? Everything that Junior is saying is very That's true. That's actually kind of true. Well, I mean, not kind of true. It's really you true. You forgive them, like even Junior. though they made fun of you the second time. You know what, Junior? Ignore them. Be yourself. And don't let the grapes of wrath get you into any trouble. Oh, we're sorry. Yeah, and we'll, we'll never do, do it again. again. Please tell me you're not joking. Please you, tell me I you're swear to gosh, I'm going to be so annoying. I will literally Please. reach my hand through this computer screen, grab you with my bare fist, put you in a bowl, and blend you up right now. I really want to do it. True. Because you grapes are very annoying. They're and annoying. so it is time for the biggest question of them all. How many times should you forgive a person? That's a good question. Um, maybe Cordy can right help now. us. Right? Go for oh, it. Look, he's playing Pong. Very, <laughs> very creative there, Phil. That's actually, you know, that's actually people, people, kind of a good thing. According to the uh, Bible. Maybe, uh, seven times? Hmm. Matthew 18:22. Jesus answered, I tell you, not seven times, but 70 times seven. Ooh, 70 times seven. And the answer is... 490! <laughs> yep, there you go. That's one smart grape. So after the grapes of Rav teased Junior a second time, he will forgive How will we forever, even answer that and very quickly? And to come up with like, a new name wow. for the grapes of Rav. Well, it's great. As, That's why. Um, Take like a little bit like 10 math. seconds to answer, right? And so the episode oh, ends with Junior and his dad going back right. home, and the Grapes of Wrath, uh, I mean the Grapes of Math, went back to their updated right. location and remembered to be good friends to Junior for many years to come. The end. Very bad CGI, though. It's time to it's talk about what we learned today. And so what we have learned. Oh, <laughs> there it is again. Oh, I want to see more of Bob's expressions. Oh, by the way, you guys, this is the episode that debuts the Bob the Tomato meme all over the internet. Okay. Very interesting. Well, Junior Asparagus learned that it's easier to forgive others when we remember that God always forgives us. Looks like Bob. Colossians 3.13b. Forgive others as the Lord forgave you. Hmm. So, so that's why we need to forgive. Well, we're out of time for today, but remember, God made you special, and he loved you very much. Bye! Bamboo! And there you have it, There everyone. we go. My review on VeggieTales. That is it. Now in the Just coffin. Like in my first episode review. Actually, it was a little bit much scared, better than the first one. The first segment, not the second segment of the episode. It's because I want to save time with my reviews. Yep. So what were my thoughts on the first segment? It's pretty good. It was pretty good. The Grace of Raps was very Much bad better. characters. Well, they were likable like, at the end. 
It's more Junior Asparagus actually stood up for himself, which is pretty cool. I like the fact that he had some genius in I think the him, second like episode the of the Fedri Tales series executed much more perfectly than the first. Because it was well, perfectly, stupidly much creepy yeah, that's with the CGI. It was like them. less cheesy. Again, God yeah, it is less it cheesy. Very much. In my next review, I'll review the 1995 episode, Are You We Don't Need to Go Further. Well, I hope you guys like this video. Be sure to give this a big thumbs up. Big thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe down here. Like the video, comment, do so, share with your friends, and subscribe for more. And before we go, the next VeggieTales reaction we're going to be watching is obviously going to be Are You My Neighbor? And if we have enough time, we can do Rag Shack and Banny. Determine this what the time limit is. This be good. These two episodes are probably uh, pretty good, but I think Are You Not My Neighbor is probably the most uh, recognized and most more um, more popular. So, without further ado, we're not going to waste any more time. We'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, everybody. Bye, guys.